Hello friends, this is Gaurav from go for e learning In this video, I am going to talking about how to get up and running the Java. So first, we will try to execute our first Java program. First step is to download JDK from this website and install it. After clicking on Oracle website, go down. First, accept license agreement. Then, my system 64 bit. So I'm downloading 64 bit JDK. So once downloading is finished, install it like this. After installation is complete, set the path of JDK bin directory. If we want to set temporary path of JDK, we need to follow following steps. First, open command prompt, then copy the path of JDK bin directory. After that, write in command prompt, set path equal and the whatever path you copied, paste it here. For example, set path equals c colon program files java jdk 1.8.065 bin so this is my jdk bin directory path so for better understanding watch in this video how to set temporary path open command prompt go to the path where my java code is present so this is the directory where my java file is present if i compile my file it will give error because we have not set JDK path. So we have to paste JDK path. Just enter, set it. And now if we compile it, it will compile. If we want to set permanent path of JDK, we need to follow these steps. Go to my computer properties, then advanced tab, environment variable, then in new tab of user variable, write path in the variable name and write path of bin folder variable value then ok for better understanding watch in this video how to set permanent path of jdk go to my computer settings then open advanced system settings then click on environment variable here you have to create new variable put variable name path and go to the jdk bin directory Just copy this path and paste it here. Click OK. So it will set this path permanent. Click OK. Next important thing is required editor where we can write our Java program. For that, download and install Notepad++ editor from this website. Open this link. After that, go to download here. My machine is 64 bit. I am downloading 64 bit notepad. Save it. Once it is downloaded, start installing like this. Next, I agree. Next, next, install and finish it. After installation, open Notepad Plus Plus Editor and start writing your first Java program. And after writing the program, save this file. For example, I am giving name first.java because my class name is also first. After that, to compile, we need to write javac first.java. It will create dot class file in same folder. Now, I am going to run this by saying java first. Don't put dot java here, just to put java space and the file name. In my case, it is first. So, I am giving java first. Now output is hello java here. This shows that java is installed successfully and it's running. For better understanding, watch in this video. Open notepad plus plus editor. Here I am going to write my first java program. I have already written. Here is a class first and I am going to print hello java. I am going to save this. Save. If my class name is first so I am saving file name first and save as java save it so this is save is created now go to command prompt go to this java file path and set the path temporary and then compile java first dot java compile it 
hit create class file here you can see dot class file now after that you can run java first it is giving the output hello java if you see in the code here only i am printing hello java so which is giving output hello java so this is all about the setup and how to run java program in my next video i am going to talk about our first java program in detail that are useful to have a strong understanding in java programming language thank you